video, we will discuss how to calculate square footage with your lengths and length segments. Add a new layer by clicking on the small green plus sign. Highlight the name of the folder you want to create your brand new layer and click add. Type in the name of your layer that you want to create. Change the measurement type from an area to a length. Different colors are always available for you. And different line styles are always available as well. And the height is where you can type in the height that you want to calculate. I want to calculate 12 foot height, so simply type it in as 12 for 12 feet. If the height measurement that you're working on has inches in it, you will have to convert those inches into a decimal. For example, if this wall was 12 feet 6 inches tall, I would have to type it in as 12.5. But I will keep this one at an even 12, then click save. Double click the layer you want to add to your drawing. When you click on your layer and it's highlighted in blue, the height will already be included down in the property section. And you can choose to perform lengths or length segments. Left click to start your measurement and click wherever it changes directions. And when you double click to close off that measurement, our program will provide you with your lineal footage and your square footage down in the property section over on the left hand side. If you have added a layer to your drawing and you forgot to add a height to that layer when you originally created it, you can also assign heights down in the property section. This wall has draw on both sides, so I'm going to add up those heights as a 24 foot height. And I'm now going to measure my interior walls with this layer. And with that, I can see I've calculated 1,201 square feet, whereas my walls, they only had drywall on one side of them, they're only at 834. In the next video, we will discuss how to calculate volume with your length measurements.